Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. How are y'all doing? So today we have got a lot of news. So Jurassic World Evolution 2 is coming later this year and it is going to be very exciting. Now there's also been some news about Jurassic World Dominion. I don't want to get too much into that because I don't want to spoil things for other people. But um, there's been a big image going on and it has teased a lot of new things coming to the franchise in the future. But this main video is specifically t uh, going to be talking about and expectations, well not my expectations, but what we hope for for Jurassic World Evolution 2. So Jurassic World Evolution 2 is going to release late this year and will give us brand new dinosaurs like the Mosasaurus, Coephysis, and Amargosaurus, and probably a lot more to come in the future as well as new game modes that could change the way you play the game, uh, new environments to build your parks on, as well as more scenery items like cacti or ferns and a bunch of cool items like that, new buildings and updated building models, and most likely updated uh, animal models and dinosaur models, and probably graphics because it's going to be launching for next-gen consoles and PC, but for those of you that don't have next-gen consoles, uh, don't worry, they're Coming to Xbox One and PS4, so, there you go. Um, and we can probably see a change in most of the dinosaur models. Um, I'll probably throw up some comparison images from the images we have currently right now available, and um, probably take a screenshot of the model uh, in the first game. So yeah, this will definitely be an interesting game, and I'm sure it will satisfy most of us as it is. But that is all the information I could gather, but I'm sure more stuff will be leaked or revealed as we get closer to the release. Now that we know everything so far, um, I would like to share some ideas that I thought w would be cool. Uh, for dinosaurs, I would imagine we'd have all the um, legacy dinosaurs from the movies and shows, so maybe we can get the Monophosaurus and possibly E750 in the game from Camp Cretaceous, maybe as a DLC or something, I don't know. And probably a new species from the new film Dominion, and probably just some other random dinosaur species they want to throw in there. Not only are we just seeing dinosaurs in the new game, but we have aquatic and flying reptiles that existed at the same time as the dinosaurs, as well as, like, Pteranodon and Mosasaurus. But those are the only two confirmed non-dinosaurs at the moment. But we could maybe get Elasmosaurus, or Poesiosaurus, or even Tylosaurus. And for flying reptiles, maybe the Quetz and Tapijara. Now, what else would be cool, in my opinion, is um, more advanced terrain requirements for your dinosaurs. So, for example, um, I'm pretty sure in some images we can see snow. Um, I don't know if that will actually be a terrain you can use in your parks, or if it's just part of the background. Let's say we have a terrain, uh, a snow terrain exhibit, and you place your triceratops in there. Um, if it's in a snowy area, it could get stressed because it would be used to grasslands and stuff. I don't know, I thought that would be cool. So yeah, that's everything we know at the moment um, for Jurassic World Evolution 2, and what probably most of us are looking for in the new game, but hey, you may disagree with me, you might not, but that's just what I thought would be cool. So yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.